Hi, this is uh, Mike with Skull Dynasty. Um, today we're going over um, Keishan Butte, a uh, prospect from LSU, um, where, who, who was six foot tall, 190 pounds. Um, his freshman season, he had 45 catches, 735 yards, five touchdowns. His um, sophomore season, he had 38 catches, 509 yards, nine touchdowns. His uh, junior year, he had 48 catches, 538 yards, and two touchdowns. And like usual, I usually watch four games and see what positive traits and what negative traits um, I noticed on film. Um, the first thing I noticed is um, Keishan Bute um, can easily separate from defenders. Um, he has uh, good speed. Uh, he's also a very witty receiver. I noticed... Um, He's very nu nuanced in the routes he runs, so he checks a lot of boxes. He's actually good at yards after the catch as well. He has a great vertical. Um, the only negatives I have for him is the off-the-field stuff. And his production wasn't there while he was injured a lot. Um, he kind of reminds me almost of George Pickens of last year, where... I liked him as a prospect, um, but injuries and off the field stuff, it, very, it feels very familiar to George Pickens. So I expect them to go most likely in the late first, early second of rookie drafts and super flex leagues. His uh, 40 time should be about a 4.4. Um, I like, he's a guy I would draft probably in the early second round. Um, or late first round. I really liked his uh, game on film, and uh, I wouldn't hesitate to draft Keishan Butte. Out of all the receivers I watched, um, I would probably have him ranked about fourth out of all the receivers I watched so far. So I have JSN, uh, Jordan Addison, Quentin Johnston, Keishan Butte. Um, next, guys, um, I'm going to be breaking down. I have on my list are uh, the next video should be Josh Downs. I'll probably release that sometime next week. And um, after that, I have Zay Flowers. And then I'll go into about four other receivers. Um, I want to do about 10, the top 10 receivers. And then um, I'll probably go into the running backs. And hopefully I'll have the running backs. Um, started by March and hopefully I can get through all those receivers um, by the end of February and then get into the running backs and then you'll be prepared for your rookie um, mock drafts. Um, after I break down all the wide receivers and running backs, I think I'm going to do like um, kind of like a rookie mock draft of how I'd rank everybody. Um, and then um, once I get finished with the wide receivers and running backs, uh, I'll probably hit the tight ends and quarterbacks after that. Um, that's all for today. Uh, have a great day.